Yo guys, welcome back. So, we are playing Command & Conquer Generals 20 years down the line. This game released in 2003 and I did play it a lot when I was younger. I haven't played it for years and you know, we're going to jump into the campaign, play the first mission and you know, we'll see if it lives up to modern standards, which I don't think it does if you're looking at the graphics right now. But yeah, let's jump straight into the US campaign. We'll do it on medium. I'm going to do it on hard or anything. Oh, here we go. Although America's military has a fragmented global liberation army on the run following the last conflict here, terrorist activity remains a clear and present danger. Heavily armed assailants continue their occupation of the Baikonur launch facility in Kazakhstan. The GLA has armed the missiles at Baikonur with newly designed chemical warheads. This arsenal is aimed towards Europe and evacuations of urban centers have already begun. A previous attempt by the Chinese to retake the facility has failed. With Chinese troops battling local warlords to the east, the United States has been asked to undertake the Baikonur mission. Tensions are high. A failed counter-strike could significantly weaken America's influence and strategic interests in Europe. From Falcon Base Command Center, I'm James Seabrook. Man, these guys need a better camera. Why, what's up with the quality? All right, here we go. I have not played this game in so long. Um, see if I can remember some of the, the campaign. It's been a long time. You know, this game came out when I was born and I didn't play it until years later. Somewhere in southern Kazakhstan. Let's see what happens. See how good these graphics are, guys. You ready? You guys ready for the insane graphics? <laughs> Why is the map broken? Oh, wait. I know where the map's broken, guys. Hold on. I know why it's broken. I'll fix it in a minute. Look at the map. Uh, and this as well. Let me see if I can fix it right now. Let's see. You can see I've got the camera height on the maximum. I was messing around with the uh, the settings on Commander Conquer Gemmel's Gentle. Put it back to the normal number, which I think is 370, I think. Oh, guys, I don't even know what it is. I think it was 370. Oh my god, what am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing to the game? Yo. Look how broken it is. Guys, I've broken the <laughs> broken the game. Okay. Welcome back, General. The GLA launched their missile from the Baikonur facility early this morning. Intel reports that they are preparing a second launch. Okay. Use of this missile will severely weaken our this. foothold in Europe. It is vital that we remove this threat. Our sources indicate hmm. that the next missile is being transported to the launch facility by train. These tracks are the only way into the facility. The first step in completing our mission is to secure and hold this train depot. If we okay, can intercept that good. train in time, we can use it as cover to infiltrate the base. It seems a bit more framey than I'd like. General. Okay, so it's definitely zoomed out way too much. I think the game's normally zoomed in. Um, oh, yeah, there you go. This is what the normal camera height is at. And I kind of broke the game by putting my camera height way too high up now oh, we're going to unlock the paladins pretty nice garrison here, here. Oh, can we capture this we need to research research to capture building here. Here. yes yeah, so i do remember this mission 
Somewhat, anyway. We have to get a lot of troops onto a train, I'm pretty sure. Not sure how laggy this is going to be as well, because I'm trying to record and play at the same time. Wait, can I shoot this plane down? I think that's something I never tried. Looks like a good run. Keep the chain. Oh, he's aiming towards it. He can't shoot at it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, that would be a war crime after all. So, you know. Uh, let's get some rocket Always squads prepared. inside of that Humvee. And also equip these guys with some of these which are good. Get these ones to repair drones. Got scout drone. I'll just mix it up a bit. I'm not entirely sure what the oil will find. Capture reduced cost of vehicles. Oh, no, that's okay. That's Let's helpful. Pop some tanks. Very nice. We've got a little supply pad down here, which is great. Let me go take out the GLA forces. There's two rocket squads just up Come on top on of that. Um, that bridge there. Let's see if I can take them out the Humvee and the send for repairs. Break it loose. Let's go. Very nice. Send him in for repairs. Let's, uh, let's turn the music down just a little bit. It's a bit too loud compared to the sound effects. Okay, now it's too quiet. <laughs> let's turn it up a little bit more. Okay, I think that's good. So we need to move up here. Okay, there's a small, small amount of GLA forces. Nothing we can't deal with. Alright, uh, let's get this soldier to capture that point. I'm doing an attack move up there. I don't know what the hotkeys are for this game, guys, so um, you're going to have to bear with me. Can you reverse move these vehicles? I don't know. Doesn't look like it. I'm pretty sure you can capture those vehicles there, which is why I'm going to load up this Humvee so I can go and capture those vehicles with these infantry here. Move these soldiers straight into the city. Car bomb. Okay, they, they dealt with that, don't worry. Do not worry about that. What's the mission, sir? What's the mission, sir? Alright, send us, send us Humvee up here. I'm gonna try and steamroll the enemy. I think that's the way to do it. Steamroll through them. Oh yeah. Okay, yeah. Special forces here. Ready for action. Let's capture these Army's Chinese elite. vehicles here. Need a point, man. Always prepared. Ready for action. Uh, jump in that vehicle. What do you need? I'm going to get the gasoline turret. Scorpions at nine o'clock. Whoa, 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 whoa! Don't push by yourself. On your command. Oh my god. Humvee here. Come on in. Doing what's right. I'm just going to grab a bunch of Hellfire drones. Paladin Extra firepower. On your command. We'll dismount the infantry because they're going to get targeted inside the Humvees. And then push forward. Put the laser upgrade on some of those guys. Although laser it's not an upgrade, but it makes them fire faster, so you know, that's good. Man, I have not played this game in so long. Yes guys, the graphics are outdated a ton. This game came out 20 years ago. 21 years ago. It came out 2003, so it's been a, been a long time. Okay, here we go. Not too difficult. So I've got a scud rocket there. I don't know if we have to destroy this, but I'm destroying it anyway. Now we need to build an attack force large enough to destroy the GLA base. Load your best units onto the train. 
So you can upgrade the Humvees with these uh, tow missiles, which are pretty handy. Need a point, man. I am big. Uh, this is, I think this is a big enough force to take these guys out. Now the weird thing about this game is these individual slots. I think you can Waiting just put like one tank into one slot. Yeah, it, it makes no sense Army's at all, elite. but is what it is. Army's elite. And one infantry takes hey, up one slot as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to chuck all the infantry inside Head the vehicles. Army's elite. Take a new position. The ones that can get in the vehicles anyway. And then we should be able to hold up less space. Let me launch one. If the physics make no sense, which they definitely don't make any sense. Come on in. How about a lift? Come on in. Polished and ready. Doing what's right. On your command. Right, so we're good. Everyone How get in the uh, the train. There's some Chinese bunkers around here, but there's no one garrisoned in them. Who is that guy? Well, it looks like some of them are walking around with mini guns or something. I have no idea what that is. But they are not going to survive very long, so do not worry. We can fit one more troop in there. Oh, we got some garrison troops here as well. Are right, you guys jump in the vehicle? Good work, General. The train is full. Here we go. We did it. Easy, easy first mission. I remember a few of the missions being a bit, a uh, bit of a pain to deal with. But we'll see what happens later on down the line. This is just a test run because you guys mentioned, or well, I mentioned, um, should I do some gameplay videos? And you guys seem to like the idea, so you know, might as well do it. I play games now and then, but I'm not much of a gamer anymore. But, you know, it's cool to have some extra content, you know. So we're playing one of my all-time favorite games. Okay, this is a. Uh, I need these guys to get out of these vehicles before they uh, get destroyed. Just the Humvees are very lightly armored. I need to move back, move back, move back, move, 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 move. Ah, damn it. That's one thing I do remember about this game is the pathfinding is a, a bit odd. Yeah, the, uh, the infantry won't move out of the way for for the uh, the tanks and stuff, which can be a bit of a pain to deal with. This is cool. We got fire. Oh, watch out! Watch out! Watch out! I'll just capture this. No, screw that. Let's just destroy it. I want to get this mission done. You guys know this is the first mission. And, okay, I think I remember at, at the end a, uh, a stealth bomber comes on and blows up this whole thing. Or something like that. I can't fully remember. But something along the lines of that. Oh, wait, I can just garrison my. Uh, prestiged soldier into the Area is clear. overlord tank. You may oh, it doesn't matter because they're about to get blown up. I got him in my sights. I got in my sights. There we go. The B is that the B1 bomber? I don't know, guys. I don't know military uh, units. I don't know their names fully. Yet. Boom! That GLA soldier just went flying out the map. I don't know if you guys saw that. I'll highlight that on the replay. You are victorious. In slow motion. <laughs> that was a. Uh, that was crazy. What the hell? Uh, that one guy survived. Don't worry, we'll do it. There's a flying tank there as well, which is great. Would you look at that? Okay, well, I somehow lost more units than I created. I don't know if that's entirely true. But, you know, we did pretty well. First mission, first win. Easy peasy. Now we'll do the second mission. With the victory at Baikonur and the elimination of a GLA missile threat under their belts, American forces face the task of rebuilding a landscape ravaged by war. Aboard these ships are tons of food and medical supplies en route to a desperate population. Although also guys, I'm sorry if you hear cars and stuff in the background, there's not much soundproofing in my room. Um, and I live right next to a road, so it's kind of difficult to deal with all the sound. So I hope you're not hearing too much. A Navy aircraft carrier is in the region to lend air support. Meanwhile, special forces continue their search for GLA caches rumoured to include weapons... Also, the squeaky sound in the background is my chair. My chair is very squeaky. Alright, loaded. Loaded. 
Loaded. Command to fleet. Keep up the fire, boys. The GLA are bringing in reinforcements. Off the coast of Somalia. Somalia pilots. Be careful what you hit. We just want to clear it out, not destroy it. You know, when I was younger, I didn't really know any of the locations this had taken place in. But now I'm a bit older, it's kind of nice to know where this stuff's going on. You know, I played this game when I was, like, under the age of 10. Very young. It came out when I was born, so, yeah. It's a long time ago. You know, despite the terrible graphics, it's still a pretty fun game. Most of our fleet survived the GLA Baikonur attack. Our aircraft carrier and battleship escorts are at your disposal to aid with this operation. Okay, nice. So we've got air support. Very, very cool. The docks have been cleared, General. I first think I remember this mission as well. While the supply trucks are brought in. Until the dozers arrive, we action. will have to defend this position with our troops as they filter in. Assault rifle ready. Assault rifle ready. So what does that do? Machine gun. Switch it to machine gun mode for... Okay, so I'm guessing that's between these. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Kind of makes sense. Sniper here. That's what it says. We've got bombardment. we got airstrike. Okay, nice. We have to do. We have to go down here. Okay, so I can try just try to minimize civilian casualties. Try to minimize civilian casualties. So we're gonna bombard these guys with the artillery from the battleships. I don't know if they actually shoot. Oh, it looks like they did. Let's right, so cut a few guys out. Preparing jets for takeoff. Preparing jets for takeoff. Are they taking off? No. Oh, can we get a radar scan? That'd be spy drone. Yes, that'd be helpful. Oh wait, it's not support power. I'm guessing I just put that onto vehicles then. I have no clue. This is very confusing. I'll fire at anything. We can fire right, the let's get these guys in here. What do we have here? Now this building should work for now. Garrison these troops take out that bunker. The warehouse needs to be secured, but the safety of the docks must not be compromised. They should be flying out to. Oh my god, okay, they're not taking. Okay, every single jet's taken off to go block this pub bunker. What the hell? Guys, I think that's a bit overkill on what's going on there. Uh, return to the aircraft carrier. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, there's still these UN supplies. Pretty sure this is a war crime, but oh well. Nothing like some war crimes in Command & Conquer. It's never been done before. I'm pretty sure there's a scene in one of the old Command & Conquer's when a flamethrower tank just runs over a bunch of civilians. So, you know, war crimes ain't nothing new to this game. Mission briefing. Defend the docks, protect incoming supply trucks, secure the warehouse. Um, wait, what's, what's supply one of. Oh, wait, it's on. Where do the supply trucks go? Oh, so I'm meant to defend this part, okay. Always prepared. Well, these guys can defend this by themselves. I'm gonna Special use that other force here. to move Army's up through the elite. city, the try and gain some action. ground. Like the old PS2 game called Gain Ground. I don't even know if it's PS2, it was an arcade game though. This is a terrible environment to fight in, in real life. Look at this. Urban warfare. Rooftops everywhere. Perfect amb ambush location. What's that? Okay, I thought that was a rocket poking out the window then. A little bit scared, not gonna lie. Unit lost. Okay, we ambushed them this time. Special forces here. Back up a bit. I'm sending artillery here and take out those defenses and here as well. Take them out. And these guys move up here. Here comes the artillery. Boom. I want to see if the artillery actually fires on the battleships. Let's take a look. Where are the battleships at? Oh, it does. 
That is a pretty cool detail. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Nest is down. Although it's turned into a tunnel now. Which isn't great. Unit Take out these buggies. Oh, they got bikes. They got bikes incoming. Reinforcements incoming, General. Reinforcements incoming. Okay, we got more reinforcements. Come on in. Nice. How about a lift? I'm more reinforcements. Here. Okay, cool. I see Why don't these guys climb up things? Oh, this, no, I must be mis I'll be your misremembering that one. Okay, how much supply trucks do we have left? I don't know how many I'm meant to wait for. Got room for five. Ready for action. I know my way around. Need a point, man. Ready for action. Okay, let's load oh, everyone up in these Humvees. Army's elite. Search and destroy. Let's pop some tanks. How about a lift? I don't care how these are um, made. Eight of ten, okay. This is an objective, right? Secure the warehouse. Yeah, secure the warehouse. I've, I've done that, kind of. Can I garrison that building? Yes, I can. Alright, cool. Yeah, it'll be a Alright, let's garrison this building with some troops. So you can overwatch. And then, uh, Looks like a good run. We'll bring these guys straight up. Nice, oh, so we got a sniper up those off. Just to deal with those. Extra infantry on the battlefield. What's this? They got this built up again. Double bombard that. There appears to be one there as well. You can just about see it on the side of the map, so I'm gonna blow that up as well. I think the double bombardment should take it out. Looks like it. Nice. Come on in. Okay. All right, let's get these guys out. Uh, let's clear these guys out as well. Good job. Give us the technicals, take to them out. The the okay, so I'm gonna do a double bombardment on that and this. It says I need to minimize civilian casualties. And is that a mosque? Um, I think I just blew a mosque up. That's definitely a war crime. <laughs> oh my god. Can't be doing that. Well, I checked the garrison. There's no civilians in this. Is, I guess. Well, I, I don't know. Okay, cool. We've got helicopters now. Nice. These guys going to move up? Alright, these forces here can support the trucks whilst they move up to their positions. In the field. Visibility clear. I'll get these. Okay, these guys. Let's split these forces up. Half the forces defending here, the other half here. Got snipers in the buildings. Go and get in there. Okay, then they can just defend the point. Got a helicopter over here. And then we we'll have one more helicopter down here. They're trying to ambush the trucks. Oh no, my helicopter's down. I didn't see that bunker. Okay, I need to take that out. Okay, airstrikes incoming. We've got about 4,000 jets in the way to blow up one bunker. Very realistic. Oh, look at that. They, uh, the rockets fall off after a certain distance. It's pretty cool. I just need to make sure all of these buildings get destroyed. Because it's going to keep sending troops out of them. So just keep bombarding them with artillery. I'm going to send one there to finish that off. Take out that bunker. Nice. Okay, we're doing pretty well. Oh, nice. We've got a construction um, vehicle. Mendoza, I think it's called. Sergeant Mendoza. Yep. Right, let's get his command cheese out. Well, not that way. I don't want to get shot. Is there even, I don't think there's RPG troops in there, so we could just take that out with, with the Comanches. Should be fine. Jets did their job. Okay, that bunker's dead. Let's see if I can get two in one with this bombardment. Let's see. They're attacking our base. They're attacking our base. Oh, no, that didn't work. Damn it. Alright, well, I guess I'll just do this then. 
Okay, nice. We've got the spider joint now. Let me put the spider joint up here, see what we can find. Okay, looks like there's a base here. Some sort of base. Oh, they both went down. Okay, cool. That does the job. How are these trucks doing? Are they... I'm not keeping an eye on my objectives. Okay, yes. Cool, I think. All the trucks are Clock good to go. In. That's nice. New construction. Yes, sir. Let's see what's going on up there. Got I think that's covered. just riflemen in there. We're gonna take that out with the helicopters. In the field. Oh nope, that is RPGs. Yeah, they're not gonna take that out. Get back, get back, get back, get back. Get back, get back. Are those flares? Do they just deploy flares? Hold on. Fly and low. Fly and low. Visibility clear. Fly and low. Unit I can't lost. tell if they just deployed flares. Visibility clear. Fly and low. Move okay, I don't know what's happening now. Um, I almost just lost my helicopter because of that experimentation. Okay, what's going on up there? Okay, there must be a base over here somewhere. I think. I remember there is a base around here somewhere. That is a lot of bikes. Right, get back, get back, get back, get back. Oh, he's getting destroyed. Get in there, get in there. Oh my god, he almost died then. There's a suicide bomber. Okay. Here. Get the Comanche to take him out. In the field. Not a problem. Time to die. Make it a sweep. Easy. Alright. Let's get a drone up there, see what we can find. Probably get shot down. Okay, yeah, they have got a base up there, that is for sure. Let's build. Unit lost. Okay, we need a sort of fly pad. Oh what there's two suicide bombers. What are these drones doing? And these drones are dumb. They didn't know how to shoot stuff. What the hell? Okay, we've got two ways we can attack this place from. I don't know which way is faster. We've already destroyed a lot of stuff that way. Where do you need me? I'm on my way. No, 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 no. Kill him, kill him. That was way too close. Oh my god. Okay, we are getting swarmed. Okay, that is a big issue there. Helicopter down. That's what took out my whole army. A scud rocket. Take that down with the Comanche. We're going in. Unit lost. Take out these defensive positions with the bombardment. In the nice, field. easy way. Okay, we, we've lost our whole army. Yeah, I need to focus on this. Always prepared. Have a job for me. Oh my god. Aircraft carrier. Guys, I was not paying attention to my base. This is a good. Our base is under attack. Army's elite. I think I should be fine. Preparing jets for takeoff. It's a good thing we've got that support powers because they're going to help us out a lot with these tanks. Always ready. Okay, we need to build our own tanks Sorry, now. I can't build there. I'm the Sorry, I can't build there. Oh, well, he's, he's definitely about to dodge that artillery. New yeah, that was... Army's elite. Okay, we do have a chin up doing supply runs. I got the suicide story? bombers. Made in the US <laughs> Get us a rocket turret up here. We do have the snipers up here still, and we still have a Comanche. Visibility clear. Let's see what I can do with the Comanche. That is a lot of forces. They have no anti air though, so this should be easy kills for the Comanche. System set. This one's mine. That one's done. 
I'm trying to intercept them with the bombardment. It's gonna. Ah, oh, just about They're missed. Our base. Oh, I've got two of them. New construction. I right, gotta repair that. Need to get some crusaders out here. Yes, sir. Got the position. In the field. Synchronized fire and like that. Fine, they're, they're gonna get destroyed, don't worry. Do not worry. Okay, let's see what they got up here. I'm gonna completely target that down. Protecting the coast. They will be there shortly. Get an airstrike onto here. USA armor Preparing division. jets for takeoff. Protecting I'm getting the jets the to target this down. Unit lost. Come on. Take it out. Target has been entered. They will be there shortly. Squadrons on its way. Commencing attack run. Because this is a good thing about the airstrikes, we can just use those to take out the long range targets. Unit lost. And I guess we can just defend our base, because I'm not making too much money um, right now. Oh, there's a supply pad there. I didn't even see that. I need to get another supply sensor up there then. Special forces here. Okay. In the field. In the We're going in. Oh, Scud Rocket. Take that out. Move to new AO. Very nice. Take out the buggy. Operation underway. This command, she's doing a lot of good work right now. She's great. Okay, that, constr that uh, construction yard is almost dead. Our base is being attacked. Take Aircraft out the supply carrier. pads as well. Nice. Nice. This oh, artillery's doing big work right now. Preparing jets for takeoff. Unit lost. Commencing attack run. Did lose a raptor. Oh no, it's fine. I'm gonna bombard these guys here quick. Bombard all of these units. Get a drone. Bombard this. This is how America fights wars in real life. Air superiority. Here we go. What are they building? They're trying to build a barracks back up. Not today. Not today. You're not building today. Alright, take out this supply thing. Guys, this is how you fight wars if you're an American general. Spam artillery, spam air support, win the war. There we go, nice. And now we just bomb this. Nice and easy. Oh, here comes a motorbike in real life. That was very loud, sorry guys. Comanche here. This Comanche is single-handedly holding this bridge off. Okay, he's going for repairs. We're going to get this supply pad. That is not a supply pad. What is that? I think if I noticed that supply pad earlier, that would have been a lot more helpful. I don't even know if I can... I can't sell structures. Okay, I'm going to sell that and then use the other supply pad. Okay, it looks like these guys... Okay, that just instantly got destroyed. So I don't know what's over there. Might be these, these little positions here. I'm going to take those out. We've got artillery. I'm going to send the jets over here to take this out as well. What else do we have? Just the barracks. Okay, nice. We'll go take that out with the jets. This is needing constant repairs. We need more tanks. Can I just upgrade this? Nice. Yeah, I'll do that. Alright, there we go. Back on our feet. And we've done it. We've completed the second mission. Let's go. Nice. Yeah, that, that artillery and those jets came in handy big time. They did pretty much all the work. I'm not going to lie. Uh, yeah, very overpowered. Maybe that shouldn't have been in this mission. Because that did pretty much just win us the game. So, I want to thank all of you guys for watching. 
What do you guys think of this game from 20 years ago? The graphics are extremely good. Far better than what comes out nowadays. That's a joke, guys. Don't worry. And, yeah, if you guys want me to do more gameplay-type videos, then obviously just let me know in the comment section. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I sound like all the other YouTubers. And, uh, yeah, I'm doing a stop-motion contest. I'll put the, the, the uh, link for that in the description and the comment section if you want to get involved. And, yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you lot in the next one. Take care.